Uh, let's get into game number two. Um, MVP have got a lot of work to do right now. Yes. Yes, they do. It's... Is there a dance they're, party they're going on back there? Party hey. This is a serious tournament. Millions Jeez. of dollars are on the line. Look at this. High quality hecklers. Jesus. Who are we going to pick? Can there be anyone else going to go Dendi? Dondo the Gondo! Dendi! No, no! We don't want you! What? I don't hear a single thing. You're not Dendi! Get back in line! Dendi, come here! Not yet, anyway. Hello, darkness, my old friend. All right, everyone. Sir, you're interesting. This is interesting. Uh, well, who do you think is going to win? DC. DC, why is that? DC. Okay, good answer. What? Can I ask what this whole thing is about? What is this? I'm the king. What? I'm the king. Oh, the, is this a monkey king thing? I'm just the king. Last but not least, Arteezy. I got three ones. Huh? You got three pictures. Your team vows you very highly. Can we walk through picture number one? She looks just like a baby razor. <laughs> Look at her. Is that, how does that? Do you know that... who this is from? That guy. He's a memer. <laughs> how does that make you feel? Do you feel like he respects you still, even though it's baby face? No, it's hashtag triggered right now. Honestly. Okay. Well, that's triggered? good. All yeah, right. hashtag triggered. Hashtag triggered. <laughs> Sorry out there. We're going to bring our two teams out into the key arena. First up, a team who have tasted success in the past, but this year. And Moose is having a lot of trouble with this as well. Like, he's trying to do damage, but there's always Morphling Replicates and Shadow Demon Illusions and just, like, so many things. It just pretty much sends a clear message here, and that's, you know, you don't mess with America. It's just not a good <laughs> idea. So. America, fuck yeah. All right, um, one last thing. It's not a question. I just wanted to tell you, don't think you're good just because you won two games with Huskar, you idiot. Three games. All right. Three games. Three games. Oh, yeah, you feel proud of yourself yeah, now? Yeah, like All right, we're out. Bye, guys. That's what you do. It's <laughs> just like that, huh? <laughs> it's their journey. And, oh, what? What do you have? Oh, please. So, what? Remember last time when we were at Manila and we sat down for the interview? Mm -hmm. He thought that you were like a Snorlax. Thank you very much, guys, for watching, and uh, that's great. All right, we'll see you later. <laughs> Day two. E home taking down Alliance in, in absolute fashion. We'll head back to the analysts to see what they have to say about that performance. Yes, thank you very much, uh, OD Pixel and Drusk. We'll head back to them for uh, game two, but uh, yeah, we're back with the panel right now. Uh Day three. They also did a really good job ganking the Invoker in the early game to keep his farm down. And at that point, it was basically just about controlling PA, and that's exactly what Wings did. So they were completely on top of that game. By you, Purge. Thank you so much for all that. Yeah, the Invoker just unfortunately didn't really have a, enough room to be able to develop and be a big powerhouse player in this one. What the fuck? We enjoyed ourselves being outside a little bit. Yeah, it was nice to be outside. People of the, the people. And uh, I think the weather's, you know, starting to pick up around here. It was a bit cloudy yeah. this other week, but yeah, I'm enjoying it. It's yeah. nice, yeah. Yeah, talking of the weather, uh, we should probably say hi to Purge this morning. So, uh, Purge, over to you, sir, with the weather. It's been. Pretty hard not to get excited about the Dota this weekend. That just makes me more excited because it's just been really nice out in the last couple of days. I mean, we're, we're sitting with a mostly sunny day, 75 degrees, and for the three-day forecast, you know, if you don't have too much hair in your head, maybe like Ted, Shane, might want to think about a hat or maybe some hair implants. Um, going towards the map as well, it turns out it's a little difficult to uh, find a non-copyright version of the USA, so we got our favorite Argentinian to do his best on this one. Um, talk about that in a little bit. There is a, a little bit of a weird weather pattern happening around here near Key Arena, and um, we're not quite sure what it is yet, but we're pretty sure it's all the OG Navi fans that are just, they just don't know what to do anymore with themselves, and they just kind of circle around catching Pokemon in the general area rather than watching the rest of the Dota. So um, other pretty fun things to look at. Um, we can zoom in here. This is actually the place in the United States where four states do touch each other. Um, Bruno had some issues with that, and uh, a bit of an interesting weather segment here too. There's this, this massive cold front that isn't actually a circle, so I'm just gonna have to make this look real crazy. It, it just completely destroyed all of the, the large lakes that America is very famous for, so that's been a bit of an issue. So 
Yeah, as you can see, just really good weather patterns all the way across the U.S. It's going to be a really good week for sun, and I hope you guys can catch some of those rays in between the games. Uh, so <laughs> That's amazing. Thanks, Perch. You're well the done, best. Kev. Well done. <laughs> Paul's speechless. He loves the weather, this man. He loves the I weather. Can't, I can't uh, do this anymore. <laughs> can we get the weather? Can we get Purge on the weather channel? Meanwhile, and we're all doing okay. Wow, 750 degrees in Gila Bend right now, uh, and 1,270 uh, in Awatuki. Now, now I, I'm not authorized to <laughs> evacuate Awatuki, but this temperature Creek. seems pretty high. Cave uh, Creek is really Yeah, Cave Creek, Fountain Hills, uh, they don't look good either. <laughs> and frankly, Wickenburg is a total loss. Oh my God. You might as well just get out. <laughs> really important question here. You're one of the only guys here at this event that has facial hair. And I want to know, is that your secret? Is it like a timber saw reactive armor? Talk to me about that beautiful hair. What's it for? Yeah, I mean, like, when I first started, I didn't have any. And I had hair in front of my face, and now I'm just, now I'm just a man, you know? I won my first land, won my first match on land. It just, it just, as soon as I won, I was like... <laughs> like so it is a timber saw reactive armor. Yeah. With every victory, your hair becomes more beautiful. Yeah, when, I, when I land land, finally, it's going to be like, you know, just... just <laughs> I'm just sitting there on the stage, like, just stroking it. I can't wait for that Gandalf to come out. That's going to be sick, man. <laughs> Can't have a full analysis, though, unless we get our proper breakdown by the one and only Perch. How's it going, guys? We have something pretty important to break down here now. A um, couple things to look at, first of all. One of these is not like the other, namely uh, this, this dress style, very different. Uh, interesting choice by Ted here. A little interesting. And another thing, really different than the other three people as well. So, I'm going to go and say that it's going to be a little too easy for RTs. Oh! You gotta go, bro! That's what I'm talking about! What? Who picked me? This man picked you! Oh, All right! <laughs> a killer! This man, a killer! <laughs> Sir, you're my last pick. I need you to look at what we got, take some time. You're the captain of the team now. What? No, 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 don't reveal it yet! I saw eight. So, so, you're just saying for Anna Pros, pick who you want. Who would you like? Uh, Who's your guy? Maybe. Maybe! Maybe? <coughs> well, you know, uh... Oh, no! <laughs> that's oh, a shame. That's right. There we go! <laughs> Call me up, baby! Come on, let's go! Hey, now, I know he just met you, and this seems crazy, but win me back. Oh! Tell us your name. Eric. And you came up here knowing exactly who you were going to pick. Of course, of course. I want to pick the legend, the Shaolin Diving Champion, QO. QO! <laughs> Admiral? Can I call you Admiral? Yeah, that works. Do you have a strategy that we can all gather behind as a team? Let's rat. Really, nigga? All right. Are you excited to be on Team Slacks, RTZ? Yeah. Ah, okay. Now you know what I deal with. <laughs> yeah, this is my life now. All right. <laughs> Too much respect for the people on my team for this. What? The hell is happening? Are we good? It, it's happening. Is it happening? Is it happening? I think it's happening. Later. How does it feel beating Slacks? Uh, no feelings. <laughs> so just I mean another nothing. day that ends in Y. Perfect. Perfect. How did it feel playing with all your favorite pros up here? Felt pretty awesome. Yeah? Pretty easy. Pretty easy? Gods. Sweet! Damn! Better luck next time, Slacks. Oh. Better luck next time. Thank you, guys. How did it feel playing the new one, the new hero? It was weird, but it was good. Thank you. 
happened, buddy? What, like, what went wrong, buddy? I don't know. We coordinated this perfect. You know, we're going to back door. We're going right, to win. I but believe in us. I don't know what happened. My team just started feeding. <sighs> <laughs> you know, just positive vibes. Um, to me, TI me, means, means a lot. I mean, it's where I started. It's where, you know, I think it means a lot to all of us because it's not just about the games. Um, it's, a, it's a celebration of who we are. I mean, the players, the viewers, the, the guys that watch, the workshop artists, everyone. It's not about um, what we uh, do and, uh, you know, the games. It's about coming together and showing that we are a family. We're together, and it's a, semutic, it's a, a celebration of us. So I just want to thank you guys for um, the celebration of us. We love you, Slacks. I don't have emotions. It was all a joke. <laughs>